have got something special for you. We are in Cebu City, Philippines, and we are walking down the different piers to pier number two to catch a ferry to another island. Today, we are headed to the island of Lete, a little east of Cebu, and we are headed to the most southern point of Lete, to Padre Burgos, where we will be staying at Peter's Dive Resort to check off another bucket lister for me and scare Cory a little. But we are going to go snorkeling with the whale sharks. The whale shark migration only happens a few months out of the year. And when I found out it was a possibility to do this, I said, I want to do it ecologically. So we're not headed to Oslob. We're not headed to Donsol. We're going to Padre Burgos to get a real interaction with these incredible animals. And I am a little nervous, but this is something I've been wanting to do for a long time. So uh, when the opportunity came about, it was a no brainer. And this ferry ride starts our adventure. So we just got off the ferry and we are now in Hilongos. We are about an hour and a half from Padre Burgos, which is where we have to go for our dive. So we're just waiting for our car to come get us and then we should be on our way. Okay. 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 okay guys, so we have made it to Peter's Dive Resort. We're gonna wake up early tomorrow. We have to be downstairs, ready to go by 7.30. We just filled out all of our forms. We're gonna do our snorkel gear, our flippers. Uh, it seemed like the water was nice enough to not do a wetsuit, so we're not gonna do wetsuits. We are about an hour, 45 minutes from the actual spot to where um, we're gonna be looking for the whales, whale sharks. I'm pretty excited. I'm a little nervous because I feel like I'm gonna see one and it's gonna scare me. <laughs> but they're they're harmless, just don't get in their way. I'm a little nervous just because I'm not great in the water. You know, things in the water kind of freak me out. So hopefully I can stay in for more than five minutes. But we are going to go ahead and get ready for bed and knock out. We'll see you guys in the morning. The next morning, I think I literally jumped out of bed. We headed downstairs, we got breakfast, and we got sized up for our fins and our masks. And we did decide to get wetsuits in the end after talking with a few dive masters. They said it does get a little cold, but it's mostly used to help protect you from jellyfish. We started heading towards the area where we might be able to see some whale sharks, but we picked up a few guests on the way. One of them being a marine biologist. She came to make sure that all the whale sharks were being treated properly and to also gather some of her own research. The other people we picked up were actually very much needed in our whale shark experience. We call them spotters. They're the guys that are continuously searching on top and under the water to see if there are whale sharks near us. It took a little while to find them, but when the time came, we all sat on the edge of the boat and one by one, we jumped in to see these magnificent creatures. day uh, excuse my voice I'm feeling a little under the weather salt water got to him yesterday yeah we just wanted to recap our experience with these whale sharks what did you think of the whole experience it was completely mind-blowing we didn't really plan being in the 
Philippines around the whale shark migration, but I'm really glad that we were here to do this because it was incredible, beyond amazing. It was a little crazy how close they were and you could actually swim with them. They are very quick, um, so you, it's kind of hard to keep up with them, but they were, you know, they were right there. And, you know, close enough to touch, nobody did touch them, but... Yeah, we were told prior, do not touch them or your day is over. Yes. So that was really great to hear too, is that it was all very ecologically friendly, and it was a very natural experience. Um, you know, we, we weren't chumming the waters or anything like that, it was, it was just very natural and they were in their environment and it was beautiful. So we ended up seeing four, we believe, or could have been the same ones. I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> I but, think it was four different. But they, we saw four different whale sharks throughout our entire trip. If anyone is interested in swimming with whale sharks, there are multiple destinations here in the Philippines, but I would absolutely recommend to do it here in Lete at Peter's Dive Resort. I did tons and tons of research looking for the most ecologically friendly option and I am super super pleased with what we saw here, what we did here. Um, out on the boat the entire experience there was really nice. We got hot tea and coffee and snacks and lunch. So it was really just a great day to be out on the boat in the water and then these magical creatures was just a mind-blowing experience. I just had a, a load of fun and there was one of them that I was actually able to keep up with for a long time. So I was able to swim with uh, one of the whale sharks for probably five minutes or so and uh, it was just incredible. Yeah, definitely a great experience. But that's gonna do it for us from Lete. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you next episode.